Hi there, my name is Michael de Miranda. Welcome to this lesson about mambo. It's not the mambo from Cuba or uh, the Poncho Sanchez mambo or it's not the Cuban, but the mambo from Bahia. And it's invented by uh, the group uh, Muzenza. Uh, and Muzenza, most of the uh, groups, uh, Bloku Aflus in Bahia, they take a lot of influences from other countries, from the Caribbean, so for, from Cuba, from uh, of course from Jamaica. Uh, they also take uh, influences from Bomba and pff, lots of influences, and they mix it with their own African heritage. And uh, so this group Muzenza, they invented uh, a rhythm, and it's called mambo. Uh, it's called mambo because uh, there are some influences from the mambo. I will explain it later. First, I will explain uh, the rhythm of actually the fundos. Let's start with the fundos. Fundos are big pseudos and uh, you've heard them. Uh, the fundo one is playing on the first beat and the fundo two is playing on the second beat. So fundo one is just playing dum, dum. Doom, boom, and Fundo 2 is playing on the second beat. So, tuk, doom, tuk, doom, one, two, one, two. Huh? So that's the Fundos. Then the Dobra is coming, and this is a Dobra, and the Dobra is playing actually what in Mambo most of the time the bass player is playing. Uh, so if you hear uh, Mambo uh, with the horns and everything, the bass player is always playing, or most, not always, most of the time is playing one, two, and tun, kung, 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 boom, 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 tun, tun, kung, kung. And that is the part that the dobra is playing. So the dobra is playing. So, on the first beat, I will damp it with my hand. The, uh, the first note is actually just before the second beat. So you have one, two, mm, pa, kung, mm, one, t, t, two, t, t. then on the second beat I will damp the skin again. So you have the second note with the stick is just after the beat, after the second beat. So you have ta, kung ta, kung ta, kung ta, kung ta, kung ta, kung, yes? One, t, 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 two, t, t, t. Uh, this is a very good way to learn this pattern. And when, uh, once you've mastered this uh, rhythm, then you don't need this hand anymore and you play, can play with two sticks. And that's what most of the time they are playing in Bahia with two sticks. You don't have to, uh, you don't play the beat anymore. So you have one, two, 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 two. like this. But in the beginning I would advise play the hand so that especially the first note you play with the stick just before the second beat. If you play the hand then you are sure that you are not playing on the second beat because that's a mistake that's often made. Yeah. Okay, that's the dobra. Let's go to the kaisha. The kaisha. The kaisha is playing uh, 16 notes. Ta 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 one two three four one two three four one two three four one two three four one two eh? and uh, the accent there's only one accent and that's the second note with your strong hand I'm right-handed so I start with my right hand not the first note is at it's uh, it's not uh, louder but the second note so you have an afterbeat one like this, yes? Let's play this. One, two, and... Yeah. 
that's what the Kaisha is playing. That's actually the influence from the reggae, eh? the afterbeat. This and mambo is actually most of the time played a little bit faster. So yeah, that's the Kaisha pattern. Let's go to the Repenique. The Repenique is playing the clave, the son clave. Yeah? So it's actually like this. One, two and pa. Yes, and that's also an influence from Mambo. So actually the part of the Dobra, the third pseudo, which is playing the bass from the mambo from Cuba and uh, this clave that's also from Cuba yeah the son clave so the first note is on the beat the second note is just before the second beat so you have ta ta one two ta ta the third note is between the beat ta ta pa ta ta Pa. Yeah. Then again a note between the beat, like an afterbeat. Ta ta pa pa ta 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 pa. And the last note is on the beat. Ta 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 pa pa ta 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 pa pa. Yeah. That's what is played on the repenique. When uh, the mambo is very fast, they just play it with two sticks, just like pra, 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 so. Like this. Um, <clears throat> but they also play it that the accents are the same, are played with the right hand, and the left hand is playing soft notes in between. So you have the right hand is playing this ta, ta, pa, Ta ta, and the left hand is playing ta tu tu pa tu tu. Eh? The first time, two notes soft with the tip, uh, because you have to avoid the edge because you don't want a rim shot. It should be softer, so you play with the tip on the, the on the skin, and the right hand is louder. So you have ta pu pu pa. One two. Then again, two notes with the left hand, again soft, so you have. Then the right hand is coming again with the accent. Yeah. Then three notes, the first is soft with the left hand, the second with the right hand soft, and the third with the left hand soft. So you have ta tu tu pa tu. Pa ti ti ti. One, two, two, two. Like this. Then accent with the right hand. One, two, two, two. Like this. And then the left hand, a soft note, and then the second. Uh, 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 accent again with the right hand. So you have ta tu tu ta tu tu ta tu 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 ta tu ta. One tu 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 tu. After this uh, last accent, there are three notes coming, and again, left soft, right soft, and then left soft. And then it starts again. So you have this ta tu tu pa tu tu pa tu 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 ta tu ta tu 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 pa tu tu pa tu tu pa tu 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 pa tu pa tu tu tu. Yeah, let's play this. One tu 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 tu.
like this. Uh, they don't play all the soft notes with the left hand, and that has to do with the tempo. So where there are three soft notes, they play left, right, left. Because if you have to play this very fast, this tak 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 tak, it will be actually quite frustrating <laughs> to play it all with your left hand. But when it's when it's fast and you play the three soft notes, also one with the right hand, you can play it faster. Tat tak 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 tak. That's why it is left, right, left. Yes. Okay, this is the Mambo from Musenza. I hope you can enjoy this lesson and use the patterns and uh, have fun with it. Hope to see you next time. Bye bye.